Okay, I'm inside Dead Horse Cave in the southeast portion called Massacus Maze. I just um, found a sort of dead end. The maze, it doesn't really have any abrupt end. It just gets smaller and smaller and harder and harder. So the trick is to give up before you get yourself killed. Obviously, I'm still alive, so I've given up soon enough. Anyway, so now I get to go back the way I came, which is theoretically easy, but you know. For one thing, I'm going down a little cliff, so I'm going feet first to make darn sure I don't end up hurting myself. Yeah, this tube I'm in up here, it's actually kind of cool because it does branch out at least two ways, but both ways got a little smaller than I would prefer. So I decided to quit while I'm ahead. Right. Oops, darn it. I bumped the ceiling with my camera. I should have paid better attention. I was busy washing my own feet. Oh, what the heck. The thing about climbing through a cave like this, you gotta be careful the different angles that you bend your body into. You don't wanna like over stretch something. Here's the way out. Oh, what the heck? Piece of junk. There we go. Uh, the flashlight like, glitches out if I bump it on accident, which in here is way too easy to do. bought my own camera with my flashlight because they're all both trying to go the same way straight through the cave there we go let's see if I can get up here
Okay, well. Caves a little bit of work, especially this portion of the cave. Okay, I think I'm almost back to where the bat is, but I still need to go straight ahead instead of back to the left. So, I'm not necessarily in a hurry to go back there. It's weird, there's a little white insect flying around in here. I wonder if he uh, is up here all year round. I mean, you know, as opposed to uh, dying or uh, hibernating or something equivalent. 